Hi students, welcome. In this video, we will study about fraud number and its significance. Students, fraud number is a dimensionless number and it describes the different flow regimes of the open channel flow. Okay, so here students see fraud number is denoted by F R like this. Okay, and here see this is the ratio of inertia force and the gravitational force so here under root of here inertia force upon gravitational force okay now we can rewrite this as here inertia force that is f i and gravitational force that is f g okay now here let's first we will calculate the inertia force so for that here see f i that is inertia force is given by mass mass into acceleration acceleration that is here m a okay so here see density that is density is equal to mass upon volume okay as we know this density is equal to mass upon volume so here from that we can derive mass is equal to density into volume okay so now let's put this mass value in this okay, equation okay so here see here now this f i that is inertia force becomes here density into volume into acceleration acceleration okay so now see here as we know here also acceleration can we can write down this acceleration that is a is equal to velocity velocity upon time so now we will put this uh, acceleration value in this equation here so from that we will here get inertia force f i is equal to density into volume into velocity upon time here okay so now here see we will get here this term volume and upon time this with this term we will get that's why here see as we know here volumetric flow volumetric flow that is here let's write down q volumetric flow q is equal to volume upon time okay so that's why we we will put this q value that is volumetric flow value in this equation we will replace this volume upon time with q okay from that here we will get now c f i that is here inertia force is equal to now we will get here density that is rho and here q that is volume upon time q and here velocity that is v okay this is our velocity velocity okay so we have got here this our first equation okay this is our first equation okay now let's calculate the fg that is gravitational force so for that here c fg is equal to here mass into gravitational acceleration that is here acceleration due to gravity that is let's rewrite is that g that is here mg okay fg for gravitational force is equal to mg now again we will put this m value it is mass value so fg is equal to we have here now 
here density that is here rho into volume that is v uh, i am writing it as here for volume density into volume and here again it is g that is acceleration due to gravity okay so now here see m we have replaced with the density into volume so now see here again we will uh, simplify this equation that is uh, fg is equal to this volume is nothing but l into l into l that is l cube length cube okay so now here see rho into l cube into g we can again write this as rho into l square into l into g that is here this l square we can rewrite as here a that is area okay so that here now fg is equal to rho a l and g okay this is our second equation okay this is our second equation okay so now we have simplified both the equations that is inertia force and the gravitational force here so now we will put these both the values of inertia force and the gravitational force terms in this force number fraud number equation okay so now here c f r is equal to we have here f i upon f g that is under root of inertia force upon gravitational force so now we will we will put the values of each each force here so here now we have f i that is this one term that is rho q v okay so now again see here we we can simplify this rho q v again further as here c f i is equal to q is nothing but here c q is nothing but q is equal to a v that is area into velocity okay from the continuity equation so here c again now rho and we can we can replace this q by a v so a v is the a is the area and v is the velocity so here a v into v so it is equal to f i is equal to we will get here rho a v square that is here density into area into velocity square so now we will write down here this term we will put this value of fi in this equation so rho a v square upon we will have here now rho a l g from this equation fg now we can cut this rho a and rho a and we will left with here now under root of v square upon l g so now again we can simplify this equation as f r is equal to square square root and square will cancel out each other so the, now we have here velocity upon under root of l into g that is here we have here now froude's number which is equal to velocity upon under root of length into gravitational acceleration 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 okay so this is the froude fraud fraud number equation so here as you can see here now fraud number is denoted by fr and it is equal to 
अंडर रूट ऑफ ग्रेविटेशनल सॉरी अंडर रूट ऑफ इनर्शिया फोर्स अपॉन ग्रेविटेशनल फोर्स विच इज इक्वल टू वेलोसिटी अपॉन अंडर रूट ऑफ लेंथ इन टू ग्रेविटेशनल एसेलरेशन ओके नोट डैट फ्राउड नंबर इज इम्पॉर्टेंट वेयर ग्रेविटेशनल फोर्स इज सिग्निफिकंट एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ दिस इज फ्लो ओवर स्पील वे ऑफ अ डैम ओपन चैनल फ्लो एंड फ्लो इन नॉच एस और व्यूअर्स ओके एंड सी हियर नाउ हियर इफ फ्राउड नंबर दैट इज एफ आर इज इक्वल टू वन देन द हियर फ्लो विल बी क्रिटिकल फ्लो क्रिटिकल फ्लो ओके एंड इफ एफ आर इज लेस सॉरी एफ आर इज लेस देन वन देन द फ्लो विल बी सब क्रिटिकल क्रिटिकल फ्लो एंड इफ एफ आर इज ग्रेटर देन वन then the flow will be super critical flow okay so students in this video we have understood about fraud number and its significance thank you students for watching this video like share and comment for this video and subscribe my channel thank you